<laughs> you look like you've been working. What have you been doing lately? I got through stripping a tub about 15 or 20 minutes ago. Stripping a tub? Strip the old coating off it. Somebody had put down an inferior coating. Okay, I've done a lot of stories on hard tops and I haven't ever heard you talking about stripping a tub. Usually you clean it with the, the four step cleaning process and right. then apply your coating on top of that. Tell me about stripping right. a tub. What have you had to do? Uh, people, they, they hear about what we do and they say, well, uh, I can do that. I saw this stuff down there at one of the box stores. And they run down and they buy this stuff for 25 or $30. And they buy all the stuff that they got to get to go with it. And they get in there and they spend a full day getting everything going. And, and then they put this inferior product on their tub. And a month, two months, a couple months later, <laughs> they call me and they wonder what happened. Hey, I got this stuff. And okay. it didn't work. So they're maybe a do-it-yourselfer like me. And I went to my favorite uh, home improvement store and I found... Uh, uh, bathtub paint right. or yeah yeah and they well, said, you read the directions and it takes you a day and if it's like me you got to go back a couple of times to get the right tool and you say it peels off but oh, it comes off it comes off Don't and so you off. have to we talked about about stripping you have to strip all the rest of that right. junk off so that you can put your good stuff on right what we do is we get in there and usually it's coming up what the heck it's coming up four or five different places yeah most, okay most times we get in there, and rather than grind it out and get in there and make a big dust mess, we mm -hmm. use a chemical stripper on it. Okay. And that keeps it, it stinks a little more, but it keeps all the dust down so that when we come back mm -hmm. and okay. do our four-step cleaning process, it's a little easier. Yeah, I had a house I was trying to sell last spring, and if I had known about that stuff at the box stores, I uh, probably would have tried it, okay, just because I'm dumb, <laughs> okay. But you, at home, you don't know this. The way I found out about Dan is, that, like I said, I had this house to sell, and it had not sold. It had not sold. I had a green bathroom, avocado green, harvest gold bathroom, and some countertops that were green and grody. And uh, evidently, you know, the people looking at it were not making an emotional connection. Right. And so I talked to you, and the first thing was you fixed the ugliest of all of it, uh, a harvest gold bathtub. Right, that was the one with all the chips we see it on the yeah, on yeah, the TV. yeah. And then I found out that he could also do tile, so mm -hmm. I did the tile. And then I had him do another bathroom and those countertops. Right, and uh, it sold. As soon as we got done with all the all those tiles. Uh huh. It yeah, it did. It sold. The bathrooms were both uh, clean, nice white, right. ready fresh to be decorated however you wanted. The countertops in the kitchen had been just an ugly green and kind of chips and spots all over them. And we didn't do just one solid color that would take 24 hours to, right. to dry. I did do that in the bathrooms and a, a little vanity. But in the kitchen, I uh, had a speckled finish put on that looked a lot better, uh, warmer, cozier. And that takes right. two days right. because they put a uh, sealant on top. Just hush, Dan. <laughs> I know how all about it at this point. They put a sealant on the counters uh, with the speckle finish to make it that much tougher. Right. Did I do good? That's it. I'm ah. <laughs> it in now. <laughs> <laughs> well, needless to say, I'm sold. I, it helped me sell a house, uh, and uh, you know, every month you go without selling a house costs you more and more money right. and makes you more and more anxious about it getting done. So, thanks. That yeah. that yeah. helped. You didn't even know you did that. That's easy money. Well, uh, Dan, if uh, they got a house they want to sell or a tub they need you to strip the junk off and put on, or maybe they're just going to skip that step and yeah. have you do it right the first time. There you go. Save you some Tell money. us how to get a hold of you. Just call Misty at 723-1599. She'll get you on the schedule. We'll get out and take a look and get your price and get going. Thanks, Dan. Anytime.